In this video I will show you how to make this basic bikini bottom for your doll. Let's get started. To make it you will need lace cotton yarn, 2 mm crochet hook, scissors and needle. Start making a slip knot. And chain 17. And starting from the second chain from the hook, make single crochet and continue making single crochet to the end. So you will have a total of 16 stitches. Now chain 1, turn your work and again we will make 16 single crochet. So this is our row number 2 and rows number 3 and 4 will be exactly the same. So you will turn your work, chain 1 and make 16 single crochet. So after row number 4 I will show you what to do next. After row number 4 chain 1 and turn your work. And now we will start making decreases. So we'll make our first decrease here from this two single crochet. Now we will work 12 single crochet. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, and twelve. And we still have two stitches here, so we'll make a decrease. Chain one and turn. We will repeat the same next two rows. So here row number six, we will start making a decrease. Later we will make ten single crochet. One, two, three, four, Five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten, and a decrease from these two last stitches. Chain one, turn work, and now exactly the same. So starting with a decrease. And later we have eight single crochet, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight, and a decrease from the last two stitches. Chain one and turn. Right now we have 10 single crochet, 10 stitches. So round number eight, nine and 10, we'll just make 10 single crochet and it decreases. So here we have two, three, four, five, six, Seven, eight, nine, and ten. Chain one, turn your work, and two next rows make exactly the same. So just ten single crochet. Chain one, turn your work, chain two, 
chain 1 and turn, and row number 11 again will be a decreasing row. So we'll make first a decrease, later 6 single crochet, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, and 6, and a decrease in the end. Again, chain one and turn. And next three rows, so 12, 13 and 14, will be again just single crochet. So we will make eight single crochet next three rows. Row number 15, again, will be a decreasing row. So we will start with a decrease. Now we will make four single crochet. One, two, three, four. And a decrease in the end. And next round, we'll just make six, six single crochet. Two, three, four, five, and six. And we will continue this until we reach round number 25. So until row 25, we'll just make six single crochet. This is how it looks after row number 25. And now we'll start making increases. So obviously chain one turn your work. And row number 26, we'll start with increase. So in here, in this first stitch, we will make two single crochet. Later, continue with four single crochet in next stitches. Two, three, and four. And in the last stitch, we'll make an increase. So now we have again eight single crochet. And next row, we'll just make eight single crochet, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and the last one is a little bit tricky, eight. Now again we will make increase, so it's row number 28, we'll start with two single crochet in the same stitch, later we have six single crochet, two, three, four, five, and six, and in the last, we'll make an increase. So now we have 10 single crochet. Row number 29, again, is an increasing row. So start with an increase. Later we have eight single crochet, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and increase in the last one.
Now we have 12 single crochet. After row number 29, row number 30 again is an increasing row. So again starting with two single crochet in the same stitch. Later we have 10 single crochet. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, and increase in the last stitch. So now we have 14 stitches and next 31 again will be increasing row. So start again making increase in the first stitch. Now we have 12 single crochet. One, two, three, four, Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, and an increase in the last one. So we have again 16 stitches like we started and next three rows, so 32, 33 and 34, we will make just 16 single crochet. So just 16 single crochet in next three rows, no increases. This is what we have after row number 34. As we can see, this part is a little bit bigger, so it will be the back part of our pants and this one will be front one. And now chain one, but do not turn the work. And here starting in this first stitch, make two single crochet one single crochet in the next space and just continue making single crochet all over your work. In these corners make two single crochet like we started. So it will be two single crochet here, single crochet all over, two single crochet here and the last pair of single crochet, two single crochet you will make here. It's not necessary that you count stitches, just work as you go. When you finish working all over, just make a slip knot here in this very first stitch that you made. And now chain one and fold your pants. So just making slip stitches. So these two parts together. You will make five stitches to join these two parts. Three, four, and five. Chain one and cut this yarn. And now you have to attach your yarn here on the opposite side and make exactly the same, just five slip stitches. I've joined the opposite side also. Now it's time to flip our pants.
and this is how they look like. Now you just have to weave in the ends and our little bikini bottom is ready. I hope you enjoyed this video and see you next time.